The remarkable ratites are members of a group of flightless birds, which includes the ostrich from Africa, the emu from Australia, the rhea from South America, the cassowary from New Guinea, and the kiwi from New Zealand. The distinguishing characteristics are their small or rudimentary wings, a breastbone with no keel, and a total lack of breast muscle. Ratites are found on all continents south of the equator except for Antarctica. The ostrich is the largest member of this group and, based on fossil evidence, may have existed as long as 60 million years ago in the southern parts of the Euro-Asiatic continent. Wild populations also existed in the Middle East and in the Mediterranean parts of Europe in more recent times. By 1900, they had disappeared from Europe, Egypt, Libya, Algeria, and Morocco. By 1912, the last ones were seen in Saudi Arabia, Jordan, Syria, Iraq, and western Iran. They are now found in reduced numbers on savanna areas of the African continent, south of the Atlas Mountains. Ostriches live primarily on the open plains of Africa, but are also known to inhabit desert, woodland, dense brush, and mountainous regions. Ostriches are adaptable grazers and eat a wide variety of grasses and forage occasionally on bushes and trees. In dry environments, ostriches supplement water needs by eating moisture-laden plants, but cannot meet their total water requirements by consuming these plants. In desert environments, ostriches wander in search of food and surface water. The wild diet is frequently supplemented with insects and small animals. This feeding habit is often demonstrated in captivity. Insects are easily digested by young chicks two to three weeks of age and can be an important source of protein and energy in the wild. Adult male ostriches are imposing figures. They can weigh more than 400 pounds and measure up to 10 feet tall. Their feather coat is primarily solid black with white wing and tail plumes. The ostrich hen is shorter and brownish gray in color. The male redneck East African ostrich has a pink colored neck. A distant cousin, the African blue neck, has blue colored skin on the male adult's neck. Males of both subspecies exhibit a reddening of the legs and beak at the onset of breeding season. The redneck ostriches are primarily limited to East Africa, with the blue necks inhabiting large regions from the Arabian Peninsula to the southernmost tip of the continent. Ostriches are a primitive bird with only two toes. With powerful legs, the ostrich can maintain speeds of up to 45 miles per hour for several minutes. These legs can give a powerful forward kick capable of causing very serious injury to man or beast. Seldom used are the ostrich's good swimming abilities. Ostriches have excellent eyesight and an acute sense of hearing. A combination of hearing, vision, power, and speed helps assure a long lifespan for adult ostriches. Adults live 20 to 30 years in the wild and longer in captivity. Unfortunately, this is not the case for young chicks in the wild. A large number are taken by predators each year. Reaching their adult height around 20 months of age, ostriches may continue to gain weight for several months thereafter. Sexual maturity may be as early as two years for the male ostrich, with the female often maturing slightly earlier than the male. The male may not become a fully productive mate until he is three to five years of age, while the hen, on average, will start laying eggs at two to three years of age. Emu comes from the Portuguese word emá, meaning large bird. The emu is second in size to the ostrich. Emus have brindled brown and black feathering which provides excellent camouflage, particularly in tall grass. One characteristic escape technique is to run from danger, then drop to the ground and lie motionless. 
The emu is native to the Australian continent and its territory covers much of Australia. It has adapted to several different climates on the home continent. The most remarkable adaptation is probably that of arid climate existence. Emus live primarily on insects, small animals, green grass, and herbs. They will also consume fruits, vegetables, and grains when available. Juvenile emus enjoy consuming large quantities of insects, such as caterpillars and grasshoppers. Emus may reach adult heights of 7 feet and may weigh 125 pounds in good condition. Female emus are normally slightly heavier than males. The emu is a fast runner and can sprint speeds up to 30 miles per hour. It not only swims like the ostrich, but can do so with endurance. Emus are capable of powerful kicks that can cause lacerated injuries with prominent nails on their three toes. Vision and hearing are very keen in emus, and they have few natural predators as adults. Very little information exists on the longevity of these birds, but a life expectancy of 30 years seems reasonable, particularly in captivity. Emus may become sexually mature in the wild between two and three years of age, at which time egg laying begins. In the wild, the male is responsible for egg incubation and care of the young. The rhea is native to South America and called the South American or Pampas ostrich. They range mainly in the Pampas grasslands of Argentina, south to the semi-arid scrub hills of Patagonia, and north and east to the edge of the semi-tropical marshlands of Brazil. Rias primarily eat grasses and leaves and have long intestinal tracts and proportionately large cica, like ostriches. Alfalfa, clover, and ceradella are also plants consumed by rias. Insects and small vertebrates are also part of their natural diet. Much like ostriches and emus, Rias have keen hearing and excellent eyesight and are fast, agile runners. Their wings are proportionately larger than the diminutive wings of emus. Large wings give rias the ability to make quick dodges while running from predators. By raising one wing and lowering the other, rias can often outmaneuver predators while running at full speed. They can also swim when necessary. Generally, one rooster and several hens will reside within a family territory. The rooster will expel all other males from this territory during the breeding season. When the season is over, aggregate groups of 50 or more birds may gradually flock together. In captivity, rias can reach sexual maturity and reproduce at around two years of age. Like the emu, the male rhea is responsible for egg incubation and chick care.